tackle. It can, but that's who Terrence Crawford is. He's not going to change tonight unless he's forced to change by Sean Porter. Terrence likes drawing him into a fight instead of a boxing match. Wait, fight out there, fight out there. Stop. Wait. Step back. to Crawford. Crawford kept his composure this whole round. Didn't seem he knew Sean Porter would come forward. It was no surprise to Terrence Crawford. Didn't want to crowd Terrence Crawford. Landed 6 of 29. Crawford landed 3 of 15. In. You got to be cautious and be ready every time he comes in. Right hook by Crawford right there got Porter's attention. Sitting right on top of the orthodox fighter. Porter just able to get away from the uppercut. Good exchange on the inside. Good action here in round two. Crawford lands a right hand. time that backhand for a moment he wants to get some get back you see that in his eyes and in his demeanor right now collected and sticking to the plan that second round was something Porter was 12 of 34 Crawford was 11 of 36 against this guy, Terrence Crawford. But it there it is. Good eye, Tim. Ooh. But it's coming. Now around the right eye of Sean Porter. That is not a knockdown. Doesn't look like much for Porter had to pick up some. A wrestling fanatic, a father of two wrestlers who are collecting trophies. Tyrese and Little T. Round number four. Punches through three. 25 to 20 Porter. Ooh. He's opened up this early. It's very noticeable when you're with him. Looks like railroad tracks when you talk to him around that right eye. And now there's blood coming from it. This is the urgency that I was talking about that Sean Porter. Good left from hand Crawford. from Crawford. Good shot right there to the body. But you see Crawford is not thinking. Forward with the right hand. What Crawford is having issues with right now is a sneak attack from Shine. Thing by going down to the body, trying to slow down Porter. Hoping that. Lunging with the right hand, he gets out of the way, and all of a sudden Porter. Short left hand from Crawford as Porter comes out of that position. That right eye that opened up due to an accidental clash in round number three. And here, Kenny, his father, saying, Sean, go left, go left. Right now, he's circling right, and that is right into the range and the track of the backhand, the power hand, Terrence Crawford. Mm. Let's look at Andre Ward's card through four rounds, 39-37, Porter. Tess, I could have easily given Crawford one of those three first three rounds. Good shot right there for Porter, but Porter would always do just enough to kind of eke out the round and Crawford would give him. Terrence Crawford, and he told me, I want Terrence to box more because that will open up the shots that he needs to land on Sean Porter. There's Porter coming in with that relentless aggression that he's known for. Terrence covering up as Porter tries to get around that guard. Terrence smiles at him and pushes him away. Now at range, trying to place that left hand right to the body. He does a few times. And then goes on the attack to close out. 
of hey you're letting him come up and just touch you at times it may not matter to you you're not being affected but it matters to the judges that's exactly what his trainer told him not and only now, the judges but but it's allowing Porter to get into a rhythm to gain confidence and it's forcing Bud to press because he knows he's behind, at least on my scorecard. Look at this from Bud the official scorecard. Early on in round six, as you see the head movement from Porter. But individuals, critics, fans, they, they got questions. And Sean Porter's asking those questions of Terrence Crawford tonight. It's a great opportunity. Touch, touch, then power from Crawford. Wide swinging right hand from Porter off the mark. Attempt at the uppercuts from Crawford. In fighting from Porter. High intensity, Vegas. Sean doing the right thing. He got one hand free. He's swinging with the opposite hand. Bud is landing, but Porter's taking the play almost every time. Against Crawford. Of getting your hands back, of being in proper position. <laughs> Always willing, right? Fought the perfect fight. Punch can change it for either guy, but so far, so good for Sean Porter. And a critical word there, the descriptive of mixing it up. There's a right hand from Porter. It's going away when you want me to come forward. It's a little bit of everything that we're seeing right now from Sean Porter. Crawford has more glaring answers or more glaring questions to answer now than he did before the fight started. Not anywhere. And for what it's worth, right, fellas, it looked like Crawford based on their face, their body language, their energy, or lack of... The bell, an opportunity to check in with Mark Kriegel and Max Kellerman. Total punches, fairly even. Crawford with a slight edge now, 64 to 60. Good combination, he catches him coming in. Two punch combination by Crawford. And so good countering both off the back foot, off the front foot. And now sharp shooting to the head is Crawford. Good start to round number eight for the champ. Could go either way. And it happens Depending often at saw. this level, Trey, right? And if they hit you right, they can hurt. Yeah, but again, it's that pop jab right off the hip from Porter. Ooh. Just missing with the left hand as Porter came in. Is in control and he's oh. Lead right hand from Porter. And another one. Shot. His father told him, ooh, that body shot right there. Wow. Oh, what a good goodness. thought from Crawford. Call to order changes of raise your level of intensity. Here we go, round nine. That's been... There's a double jab from Crawford. What Kenny Porter is asking his, Sean, his son Sean Porter for is separation. Check hook again from the southpaw. Dang, that's what he's asking for. <laughs> Looks like Porter wants to take a round off and Crawford needs to take advantage. <laughs> Left hand to the body again and again. Lead left hand from Crawford. As Porter keeps taking those steps forward. Both guys landing some counters right there, exchanging. Going underneath with the left hand to the body. Body work in that last round and the short uppercut that we showed. There are the body punches. 28, and there is the knockdown scored in round 10 by the champ. Terrence Crawford catches Porter early in round 10.
And now patiently probing. Seeing what could be behind that jab. There's a combination. There's a lead left hand. Porter looks good on his feet, but not coming forward and firing at Crawford for the moment. There's the overhand right, and another combination! Beautiful work by Crawford! Magnificent accuracy by the champ!